Danny Cole's 40-yard touchdown grab made it 14-0 Virginia Tech. Thomas has run for one and thrown for one and outpulled his ball club down by two touchdowns here with 14.53 to go in the first half. Justin Meyer was put two out of the end zone going in the other direction. Has this one eight yards deep and Miami will take it in the to number six. He goes in motion. They'll throw him a little swing pass. And Virginia Tech is right there up from the corner. Kyle Fuller. He faces the second and 16. Virginia Tech showing blitz. They don't come with it. There's a screen. And it's Eduardo Clements. This was a very intelligent play by Ja'Cory Harris. Immediately, quickly, realizing the pressure was coming from the outside and got the ball in the hands of Clements so he could turn around and run. For Clements, only his second catch of the entire year. And now Miller back into the more traditional tailback spot, and Miller comes off the left side. Ball carriers, number six, Laura Miller. Derek Hopkins made the tackle. Miller in that same company. Has exceptional speed around 4-3, and he can break tackles, but he's not going to break that one. Today. Just perfect weather. Miami with another third and long. Ja'Cory Harris in the shotgun. Blitz coming. Harris got away initially and then knocked the tackle after Bruce Taylor flushed him up in the pocket. Six folks coming. Not enough blocking. Ja'Cory Harris could not look down the field because he was trying to avoid rushers. Kick takes a good Miami bounce. And we'll go inside the third. Great start for Logan Thomas, who rolls to his right and throws complete right on cue to mark do something Davis. differently because the secondary is not covering up receivers. Wilson hasn't been that much of a factor yet. He'll get a carry here. Cuts it outside, gets a block on the corner, midfield, 45. 15-yard gain. We got more than 200 yards a game. Wilson trying to add to today's total. Down to the 37-yard line. Uh, That's amazing. <laughs> he obviously has never been in that position before. <laughs> Wilson again stutter-stepping inside the 35 to about the 40. <laughs> David Wilson, the tailback. Coles, the man in motion. Wilson. Well, they're getting a big dose of Wilson on this possession. He's down to the 20s. It's another first down. Wilson's trying to avoid. Oglesby will come in to give him a breather. Instead, they throw out to the flat to Marcus Davis, and Davis is inside the 15. As far as Wilson, the first five thing is, Miami had been able to put pass pressure on quarterbacks, but they haven't gotten even a hint of getting into backfield here. Davis on the end around, no chance. Anthony Ciccolo. Slow was developing the first one there. Right there. There's a leader of that defense. Three for three this afternoon in third down chances. Ball's bobbled and almost another third down error. That ball was loose again. It certainly looked like Logan Thomas had it back on the ground, but the official said no, he didn't. He never had possession, and they the ball had to came find a way loose. to force turnovers, create turnovers, because they could not defend the goal line on long drives. They were looking at 21 nothing, and maybe being out of here. Yeah, he just never had the ball secured. Heads up play by Miami's defense. He almost had it. Now. Miller. Room. 12 yards. Antone Exum made the stop. He just got to hold on to it. Miller tried to take it outside. The Hokies play team defense, and if you're dancing around, it was going to have to be tough running. Lamar Miller going to have to get between the tackles and those shoulder pads. Got to be tough, tough earned yards. 
Miller better cut that time and room to run across the 50. They want Miller, or rather, that's Mike James. And they're asking their running dedicated this game for her. Miller back in to the 46. Only 30 carries for him all year. 31 right here, and James tripped up as he got to the 49-yard line. That's James the, the tailback. The veteran Ja'Cory Harris. And here's movement up front. And it's the right tackle. John oh, sorry. Seattle, 70. A okay. red shirt yards, freshman. Second down. They show blitz. They come with it. Harris flushed and throws it away. Harris out of the pocket and making scrabble and throw up one like he just did. Bud Foster, one of the great defensive coaches in college football. Harris with time. Deep down the sideline. Out of bounds. Hearns made the catch. Boy, was that close to the sideline. I'm not sure he didn't get one foot down. Yeah, that was just a beautifully thrown football by Harris on the outside to where only the receiver had a chance for it. I'm not sure he has possession yet. I, I, I think it's a good call. I think was, by the time he possessed it, it, it becomes part of this game. Uh, well, we've shown you all the replays we've got. Now they're taking a hard look at this thing. You know, just uh, going back this afternoon, it is confirmed that Florida State did lose to Wake Forest, and, and Tanner Price that? threw four touchdown passes against Florida State today. Wake Forest is going to be tough. Sometimes when they do this, take this long. After further review, they're looking the at Miami the Miami receiver mark. completed the catch with one foot in bounds, Ooh. and then went out of bounds at the 15 yard line. Therefore, it'll be first and 10 at the 15. There's the break Miami needed. Yes, sir, you're right. And, and, and you know, they, they stuck in there. They looked at it. And, and obviously came to the conclusion that that right foot had not yet left the ground and that he did indeed have possession. So well, I just, that, yes. that, that, that offensive line. Time. It's time for the offensive line to push him off the line of scrimmage. And Miller is back in there. That's good news for the Kings. Corey Harris changing the play. Miami shows blitz. Pass for the end zone. The officials looking at each other. Nobody has made a sign. Now it's a touchdown. And it's Hearns again. Hearns in the corner. Now, neither one of these guys wants to give the ball up. Well, they're going to go back and have to review this one as well. But Hearns is a guy that the coaching staff said really showed up this year. Does a nice job of adjusting to the ball in the air. This one here, the feet are there. I think they were looking to see the tussle. That really looks like a touchdown. It's a simultaneous catch. Therefore, touchdown. They are ruling on the field. It is a simultaneous catch in that event. The tie goes to the offense much like in baseball the tie goes to the runner wow what a play what back a to back to two great throws and great catches on back-to-back -back plays and they're within seven they're back in this game boy i tell you what that was that was either a 10 or a 14 point swing right there and tone exum never saw the ball Hearns did. Touchdown, Miami. Wilson, number four, Gregory, 22. Wilson last year led the ACC in kickoff returns. Oh, man. Well, he got slugged on that one as he got out to the I didn't think they beat Oklahoma, but I didn't think they'd lose right. the other two. And certainly they played well enough in the Oklahoma game to give them hope. What a swing Oglesby. Had to wait for a blocker. And when he did that, could work its way back up a little bit after this if they can beat Miami. Oglesby picks up about three. A Jomo on the tackle. He's got us coming along on third downs. They got a chance. Big third down here trying to keep the ball late stages of the first half. Thomas 
And there was a lot of contact before the ball. Ray Ray Armstrong spun around. Danny Cole. His first action coming back off of the NCAA suspension. I just don't. I'm not even sure this ball is. Oh, he was full. He was. Absolutely. And David Wilson. Now he's back in the game. He had a little bit of a rest, so he'll be fresh. Thomas. Chase from behind, didn't see the pressure, throws back and completes it to his tight end. Chris but you can't do that if the offensive line's not doing their job. And with only four rushers, he's had plenty of time today. Craig, he's 10 out of 11 for 152 yards. You can't ask for much more than that. Back to throw again, a little swing out in the flat. Wilson. Picked up maybe 10. You know, you hear about put a seven on his back. <laughs> I mean, these guys have had enough biscuits. <laughs> Thomas all day to throw. Dumps it again to his running back, Wilson. Well, Miami is not going to be the rhythm, and Logan Thomas showing he'll find them. Quick out. That'll be a first down to Boykins. And Boykins on the first half clock. Wilson on the delay. Boy, big shot from Sean Spence. Just squared up and drilled him. <laughs> Flanker screen to the four. They hit D.J. Coles. That was beautifully executed. It is 14 out of 15 in the first half. That, that little quarterback with his own read where the quarterback keeps it midline. He's a huge weapon at his size. Yeah. That will be a first down. Miami start. having a hard time getting lined up. Keeper, nothing doing. Thomas swallowed up at the three. They're going to have to use their last timeout. Can't be sacked. You can't complete it short of the goal line. Thomas underneath, and the official was knocked out of the way. Now makes the call. Touchdown, Wilson. Linebackers were so focused on the inside. Really on the field is a touchdown. That's a touchdown. The previous play is under further review. That's a great play. But the linebackers on the inside who are supposed to be in the flats covering David Wilson were so concerned with Logan Thomas running the ball. Sure. Left him wide open out on the outside, and that's an easy three for Jermaine David Wilson. Wilson. The point after. And Virginia Tech answers Miami's only score of the ball game. They've taken it Sunday. Sunday. Matt Stafford has figured out that that extra yard above everyone else for Calvin yeah. Johnson. You can't stop yeah, them. Yeah, that's right. They're unbelievable. That's right. They, the one touchdown pass. And he's running pass. the ball. His shoulder obviously okay. The trigger man may have arrived in this half at the may Virginia Tech. <laughs> Ja'Cory Harris. Trying to buy a little time. Now Chaston throws it away. The half is over. No, no one to throw to. I mean, it is, it just, and at least Miami got on the board. They've got to find a way defensively to handle Logan Thomas, and it's going to come in the form of blitzing. At the half, our score, Virginia Tech 21, Miami 7. Now let's head to the studio for our halftime report. Welcome in to the Cooper Tires Halftime Report. Great to have you with us.